So let's go ahead and create our project structure. Um, the th I'm in, let me just print my working directory here. I am in application exam ht docs, which is my working directory for uh, exam. Uh, if you're on Windows or Linux, it could be a little bit different, so we'll go ahead and look at the documentation for that. So I'm going to go ahead and create uh, a new directory, and I'm going to call mine Rua. Uh, you can call yours anything you'd like. Uh, so then if I ls, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, cd into Rua. Oops. And then I'm going to fire up Atom. And now I have an empty project here. So if I create a new folder, uh, we need a folder for app. Um, let's see, we're going to need a folder for config, uh, directory for core. That's where we're going to put all of our core files. We need a directory for our CSS, fonts, uh, JavaScript. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and create a new file. We'll call this index.php. Um, and then, so our index.php, we're going to say, uh, welcome to Rua uh, MVC. Inside of our app, we're going to have some more folders, and this is where the MVC part comes in. So we'll need a, a controllers. We'll need a models. Um, views. So you can see how we have our MVC now. Uh, controllers, but I'm also going to give it um, a folder for a lib for a library, and uh, let's see, inside of our lib folder, let's create another folder called helpers. So we're going to put our helper files here. So now that we have our, our root folder, we have our app. This is where all the front ends are the actual application files are going to go. Config is to configure the framework. Um, and then we're going to have our core classes that actually uh, build the framework in the core folder here. We'll also have some other classes that help us out with some different things. And then we're going to put our CSS and our JavaScript and things like that in these folders here. Um, but our, m the main bulk when we're working of our, on our application once the framework is built, say we're going to start a new one, we start here and the con we would just start with building controllers, models, and views. So I hope that helps and we'll see you in the next video.